Right now at six, a special education student who wasn't supposed to be left alone walked away from Inskip Elementary School last week. A Knox County School incident report says he made it about a quarter of a mile before police found him. Tennis reporter Vinay Simlot shows us how that elementary schooler walked away and how police eventually found him. An Inskip Elementary student wasn't supposed to be left alone at school. Police say he was, and he walked out. Around 1046 last Wednesday morning, the Knox County Schools incident report says the student walked out of the old main entrance. School staff realized he disappeared and called the school security officer. The report says police found the student on Glen Oaks Drive. That walk could be a quarter of a mile to half a mile, an 8 to 12 minute walk from the school in North Knoxville. Police found him around 11, meaning he was missing around 15 minutes. School staff walked him back to school, a nurse checked on him, and the school called his parents. Vinay joins us now, and Vinay, this is a special needs student who certainly is not supposed to be left alone. No, the report says he is a special education student. KCS says they created a safety plan because of this incident. The school district says they want to make a plan to meet the specific security needs of that student. And again, just to underline, there's more to be done, more investigating still going on. Yes, we don't know why he was left alone. KCS says they're still investigating. Vinay, we appreciate it. Thank you very much.